Hello everybody and welcome back once more to Sly Cooper Thieves in Time. I am the Outback Al and we're here in the prehistoric era. We just last time got a bunch more treasures, found a bunch of other treasures that I don't know that we're going to be entirely able to get at this point. Uh, and we also cracked the safe and got all the bottles and all that. Well, we got the bottles, then cracked the safe. Can't do one without the other. But I think we're going to get a little farther now, story-wise, and... I don't know. I don't know how many tasks are left. I know we got two parts to the to the time machine. Which means there's probably one left that we need to get. We have new ammo. We really like Bentley. Really gets loaded out with a bunch of stuff. All right. Let's see here. We got to go to the cave system. Is this a giant wind tunnel? Paid assistance, check. Guard ammo, check. Tire pressure, check. Bentley, how many equipment checks are you going to do? Just being prepared, Sly. A field operative can never be too careful. Or watch too many spy movies, apparently. They're good reference. Those ice caves are a uh, textbook example of a villain's hidden operation. Relax, pal. It's simple. Use the thermovision to find Grizz, tag him with the homing dart, and let him lead us to his lair. Avoiding any lethal obstacles or bloodthirsty guards along the way. Of course. Yeah. Right. Simple. Honestly. I'll see you back at the hideout. Bentley is someone who relies so much on technology should constantly be checking his stuff. Hmm, a dead end? I think not. Time to use the thermovision. Do I have thermovision? Oh, here we go. Oh, interesting. Okay, so he walked that way. Hmm. That worked out. Honestly, I'm kind of interested to look around a little bit. I really feel like there's probably gonna be a mask somewhere in here that I can steal. You're gonna have to track it, Bentley. Yeah, I get that, Sly, but let me look around a little here. like it did, so we went that way. I want to see what's in here first. I'm thinking... Oh! Okay. Too close. Gotcha. Did not think I was too close, but okay. A dead end? I think not. Time to use the thermovision! Yeah, I'm good with that. Come on, mask. Maybe something around here. Follow his footprints. Slappy to these things. These things, things go down quickly. All right. Should have gone down this way. If there's any indication, it's probably the graffiti. 
Yeah, they say I'm like Da Vinci, master with a brush. When my art is on the wall, it makes the crowd hush. There he is. Tag him, Bentley. Hold on, Sly. There's something funny about that painting. Okay. What happened, Bentley? He was right there. I'm sorry, Sly. It's just this artwork. Hmm. Just as I suspected, the statue and these paintings have a few things in common. Okay. Fire. Oh, what the hell was that? about this statue. Can I shoot some of it? Uh -huh. Way to go, pal. I bet I could activate hey, them with my dart gun. Yeah, go find that bear. He's looking around. There's gotta be a mask somewhere, right? Hmm, this must be how Grizz moves the eggs back to his oh, mountain base. Okay, so it looks like there's some spots in the wall where I can hide. So that's something. I need to get out of the way. I use those gaps in the walls to avoid the eggs. This is like some kind of bad dream. Hey, health. Always good. Second. There it is. All right. All right, peep this. We are on high alert. Nobody goes in or out but the grid. I gotta go finish your paint. You dig? Good. Now take these and keep your eyes. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Jewels. Looks like that door is missing something. Yeah, a makeover. No, slide. I'm sure the gems Grizz gave the guards unlock the door. I'll hmm. just have to get them the old-fashioned way. By asking politely? Money. No, by picking some pockets. I can't tell which guards have them, though. Go for all of them. There's another way. How about using thermovision? I think you're right. Wow, this is a first. Okay. Now who's being funny? I better use the thermo vision to see which guards have the gems. I can't let these guys yeah. see me or I am history. No, no, and I think yes. Over here. Yeah. Okay. Ta da! I thought there were three gems, but we're only seeing two. Alright. Pretty sure you were the other one who had it. Oh. There we go. Someone else has one, though. I didn't see it on you. Or you. I'm guessing it's you. 
At least more than likely. Well, you got a very short little track you go on. There we go. Great. Okay. Now to use these on that door. You won't shake this tail, Chris. Uh, did you just say something about shaking your tail? Fly it, Sly. I've got a pair to catch. <laughs> okay. I don't know why a crystal would give off thermal no way stuff, I'm going but... Out egg salad. Keep it in the wrong thing. I'll never read it over again! Okay. Oh, jeez. Hey, don't forget, breakfast is the most important meal of the day. Don't slide. I'd much rather sleep in late. Oh, here we go. Okay. This looks to be about where I need to go. The quiz gotta put some art on ice. Gonna dig it up later for a big fat price. The paradox is a stinking dude, and I'm getting real sick of his attitude. It looks like Grizz is planting fake cave paintings. He's working a prehistoric art scam. I get it. Them here, then goes back to the present, digs them up, and sells them for a fortune. What a con! Hurry up and tag him before he gets away again. Right. Just to be safe, I'm going to use multiple darts. Three should do the trick. Belly, you need to make sure those darts stick to it. Aim for that rip in his pan. Oh, jeez. Time That's to put the dart gun to the Oh, jeez. All right, here we go. Okay, all right. Damn it. Show me that big booty. Come on, faster, faster! What is going on? Ugh, fence? Are you kidding me? That's what's getting in the way. Uh. Great shot, Bentley. I can't shoot through all this ice. You need to move. Uh. I think this job is going to require three darts just to be on the safe side. Still can't see. The Grizz don't have all day. I got placed to be. Bentley, did you hear that? Hurry up and tag it. Come on. Oh my god. Full side. Just one more. Yeah, I'm not going to get that. Wasting too much time in the first two. Just keep moving, Bentley. You don't have much time. All right. Fuck. Almost got the shot off. Okay. Yeah, don't just shoot from the hip. Yeah, 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 I get it. You need to move. Huh? What? 
Okay, this is getting annoying. Okay. Cool. Shut up. You need to move. Boy, he is frightened in that moment. Can't see it. All right. Once this drill does its thing, I'm out. Bloody Bentley, did you hear that? Hurry up and yes. tag him. Bullseye. Just one more. All right. Come on. Don't give me, don't give me stuff. Stupid machine. Shut up. Moving, you don't have much time. <laughs> Very nice. Yeah, I shot the guy thrice. Sorry, the rhyming is contagious. One of these days he's gonna get served. Yeah, the Grizz is gonna crush that little nerd. <laughs> Finger guns. Okay, we got anything on Thief Net? Got a lot of money lately. Shrinking ammo, cool. That should actually like load out completely for Bentley. Sly's turn. We still got a lot of masks to find. We still got a lot of uh, treasure to find. But at the same time, I don't care about that at this point. Let's just get out of the Ice Age. And on to anything else. Okay, so we've essentially figured out what the scam is, what he's up to. So now, I don't know, do we have everything that we need to beat him? Okay, Sly, this one's pretty simple. Tail Grizz until you can get the code to his fortress. We need to get in there if we're going to stop him. You shouldn't have any trouble finding him since he's tagged with the homing darts. Just follow the signal. We probably didn't even need the darts. He's kind of hard to miss. Okay, mm -hmm. he's on the move, Sly. Stay close so I can pull the data we need off his phone. And don't underestimate him. He's no lightweight. How is his phone working right now when he, uh, you know, there's absolutely no cell phone you see, I'm going on right now? Scary. And all of that stuff. No cell towers? Get out of my way. Oh, I'm going to get rough. What? <laughs> Gonna make me a fortune. I'm the greatest around. All I gotta do is plant my art in the ground. Getting that data yet? What? Fool, you trying to run some kind of game on the Grizz? I'm tired of you telling me to walk the line straight when you walking it all crooked. Yeah, that's right. Uh-uh, uh-uh, no, no, no. That ain't the deal we had. Nuh-uh. No. I got you the cane that that big old hairy dude made. Now you need to hook me up. Hook me up. Yeah. Ho hold on, hold up. I'm losing signal. Hold up. I said I'm losing signal. I said you shouldn't have a signal at all. There's no cell towers. Hold on. Did you catch that, Bentley? Yeah, sounds like he's talking to La Paradox, and there's trouble. Don't lose him. You got the Grizz? Live at large with a brush. Don't step on my canvas, cause you'll just get crushed. I am glad there's so many overhanging stuff around here. Some... Hold up. <laughs> Man. Nah. Hold on. 
He kind of reminds me of Dimitri a little bit. Why do like that to talk to Dimitri? You really want Dimitri calling you? Good point. Forget I asked. You know, with Coopers running around, you'd think most people would look up half the time, but it's better that they don't for me. I'm sorry, what's that? Oh, come on now. I scratched your stinky, stripy little back. Now you scratch mine. Not only that, I got those other crazy Cooper folks messing with my business now. So I gotta deal with that, and I don't see you giving me any help. No help. No. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I'll, I'll take care of it. Huh? Oh, oh hold on. It's, it's a reception, man. I can't hear you. No, you can hear me. I can't hear you. You chop it. You <laughs> chop it. You chop it. <laughs> I, forget it, man. I, I, Sounds like his deal with my paradox isn't going so well. Oh, poor guy. I feel so sorry for him. Yeah, I'm crying over here. Just stay close. I'm still trying to access his phone data. Batman. He's right above you. He, you! The paradox, that skunk. I don't care what he thinks. The best thing you can say about that shrimp is that he stinks. It feels like you should have tried for a music career or something. So I'm rolling. I'm flowing. So bad it ain't fair. The quiz will teach the paradox. Don't mess with the bear. <laughs> Farting? Don't give me that. We had a deal since day one, and I did my part. I did my part. I, I need those eggs, and I need them yesterday. Don't leave me hanging, because I will come find you. Oh, oh, you think I'm scared of you? Only thing scary about you is the smell. Yeah. Hello? Hello? Stupid phone! I'm finding this all pretty entertaining. Yeah, it gives us an advantage if Grizz is off his gate. Watching this bird, this stupid ass bird. Did we make a giant circle? I think we did. He's gonna get away from me, huh? Now let me tell you how it is. I am an artist. I got paintings to create. And I ain't putting up with any more of your excuses. Now, you give me the eggs I need for my paint, or I climb through this phone and squeeze them out of you myself. You got that player? Hello? Hello? Why you did that? Dang! <laughs> Alright, well we got the code no, to get in. I was so close! I guess that means you didn't get the code? It does. Looks like we're back to square one. I guess the bear got away, huh? Carmelita, <laughs> it's good to see you. Uh-huh. I'm only talking to you because I have some information for Bentley. I've been telling Grizz on my own. And I have the security codes and full schematics for his mountain base. Wow. She's good. Thanks. You're welcome. So you'll get it to Bentley for me? Of course. I'm headed back to the hideout now. But wouldn't you rather hand it to him yourself? Maybe I should. After all, you're not exactly trustworthy, are you? Ouch. <laughs> so, we're good. 
It doesn't sound like it. Don't push your luck, Ringtail. I think I'm getting too used to this Batman costume. I caught up with the Ringtail to give him the intel I'd gathered on Grizz. Half of me still wanted to slap the smirk off his face. You the could. Other half wanted to talk. Working on my own these past few days had given me time to think, and I'd realized some things. Sly may have been lying to me the whole time in Paris, but I'd lied to myself as well. In my heart, I knew something was up, but I didn't want to admit it. I wanted to believe he'd changed, that maybe I'd changed him. But Sly was who he was, and I had to accept that. Although this crazy time-traveling business had given me a new perspective on that, too. In the past, I'd always chase Sly, arriving on the scene <laughs> after the fact. But now that I'd fought alongside him, with Bentley, Murray, and his ancestors, I had to admit a newfound respect. We aren't really so different. We both fight for justice. We just do it from opposite sides of the law. The question is, uh, can I live now he's with very that? Batman. Honestly, I don't know. But for now, perhaps it's enough that I see things more clearly, and that we have a common enemy in the paradox. Because I am not going anywhere until I put that stinking weasel behind bars. He's a skunk, but okay. Also, you guys have been teamed up before. It's not like you never. I'm pretty sure. Ooh, flash bomb. That's cool. I'm pretty sure you guys have teamed up on a number of occasions. Anyway. Uh, I think that's about it for today. We're gonna, probably going to finish up the prehistoric shenanigans next time, so we'll see you then. Bye-bye, everybody. Hey, thanks for watching, and if you haven't already, be sure to subscribe and ring the bell icon for notifications. If you enjoyed this video, give us a like, and feel free to check out some of our other gaming videos, our weekly podcast, Anime Yay or Nay, or our parody series, Madoka Magically Abridged. See you next time!